I'm sat down with Helen, one of the members of Time Team, who's always been around as our expert on Anglo-Saxon stuff, but I think in the last 10 years we've realised how much she knows about portable finds, what we call kind of bits of stuff. And we actually came here because of a contact Helen had, um, and it's been really interesting mixture of things, the racing, the archaeology. How did, you, how did you get that original contact and what made you think it might make a good time team? Well, I'd known Chris for about 10 years. We used to work together at Norwich Castle Museum when I started out working with metal objects. Um, so I knew he was, I knew he was, he was very good at what he does, you know. And then the first week he got this job, he phoned me up and he said, I've got to do this enormous redevelopment of the museum, because I'd been to the museum and I knew it was very small and very crammed. And I thought, well, yeah, obviously you have. And he said, and I, I'm expanding into these enormous courtyards and they're going to need excavation. And so I think Time Team should come and, well, originally he thought it would make a good Time Team special, because he said, well, the work's got to be done anyway. Why doesn't Time Team follow it over the years? But then, when we started talking about it, we realised that there was so much, so much that could be done that it would make quite a good three-dayer because there's so much intense archaeology that you just need to dig a small hole, as we've seen, and you get so much in it um, that, that it would make a good three-dayer instead. And have you been pleased about what we've turned up for him? Do you think this will work for him? For him, I think it'll work absolutely brilliantly because what we've essentially done is, said, is shown him that he can trust the plans that he's got, because he's got a fair number of, 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 of plans of what was here in Charles II's time, right. and we've shown him that, that he can essentially trust, trust them. We've only come up with one really surprising modification to the structure, this enormous clunch wall that, that we've been scratching our heads about ever since lunch today. And w what I'm hoping is that, um, I'm sure with Helen and Chris, what I'm hoping is that in the last two or three hours of Time Team, we're going to go down a bit deeper and see if there's an earlier structure represented by that big wall, which I think Cassie...